Hey folks, Darren here with Milner Tools. I wanted to answer a question today that we get from time to time at trade shows and via email and also social media. And that's, why is our de bit designed for harder metals and more abrasive materials and yet not designed for softer metals? Things like copper, brass, aluminum, even some of the softer mild steels. The answer is in the tip design. Our bit is 118 degree flat grind. That bit files through the material. Harder metals file easier than softer metals when it comes to a drill bit. A traditional bit, like this one here, cuts through the metal. It's designed for cutting. That's why you get ribbons when you come up off of it. So filing and cutting. And folks, one easy way, at least for me, and if you like food, this will probably make a lot of sense too. One easy way for me to articulate the difference between a filing bit and a cutting bit is cheese. Now hold on a minute. Why are we talking cheese when we're talking about tools? Follow me into the kitchen and I'll show you exactly what I mean. Welcome back folks. I wanted to bring this video into the kitchen for a moment because A, I think it articulates very clearly what I meant, the difference between cutting and grinding. B, I'm getting hungry. Now we're gonna do this quick because we've got a hard and fast rule in my house. No power tools in the kitchen. So we're gonna do it quick, and I'm gonna hope I don't get caught. Our bits, remember as I mentioned outside, designed for hard abrasive materials because it's a filing action, not a cutting action. A traditional twist bit, more for cutting. Softer materials, copper, brass, aluminum, mild steel, that type of thing. I'll show you what I mean. When you're trying to cut something like a hard cheese, like Parmesan, it's very difficult to cut that. You actually file it or grate it would be the term. So I'm grating through that cheese right there. I'm not trying to slice it. When you work with something softer, like mozzarella cheese, very difficult to grate mozzarella. It tends to just crumble. So you slice it, more like what a traditional slicing bit would do. Hope that makes sense, folks. Time for me to have 